Jordan E. Cooper is an Obie Award-winning playwright and performer who was recently chosen to be one of Out Magazine's Entertainers of the Year. Last spring, he had a sold-out run of his play, Ain't No Mo, a New York Times critic's pick. He is currently filming The Ms. Pat Show, an R-rated old-school sitcom that he created for BET+, which will debut later this year. Hilarious, bombastic, electric, Jordan Cooper's plays celebrate spectacle and explode conventions, mixing the taboo with the silly, the profound with the profane. This mordant yet exhilarating work raises a glorious cry of anger. Soulful and richly characterized, it is full of tender beauty and terror and joy. His plays dwell both in the real world and the beyond, a reality in which anguish and hope coexist in equal measure. Hi. Uh, I'm reading from my piece Ain't No Mo, um, and uh, I, this is from a character of Peaches, uh, who's a fabulous drag queen flight attendant who is helping millions and millions of black folks get to the new destination of Africa. And this is a monologue that she's delivering to a very reluctant passenger. Easy. Didn't nobody say nothing about no easy. No, you ain't heard me say nothing about no easy. Easy don't know me and I don't know easy. Easy. Nigga, what you doing? That shit is hell ain't making shit easy for nobody talking about some easy. Nigga, you know how many more of these motherfuckers I still got to scan in after you? Do you know how hard these damn heels is raping and stabbing my damn feet? Do you know how much sweat this wig is keeping from gushing down the front of my damn face right now? Do you know how hard it was for me to wake up this morning when the sun started yelling out my name easy? <laughs> From the moment they plucked me off my mama's peach tree, I was ripe, round, and full of juice. And if easy knew me, I wouldn't be wasting away in a world full of folks who hate peaches. I got my ass whooped last night by a group of jealous niggas who was pissed that I looked better than the bitches they fucked the night before. There weren't even white folks that did that. They look like me. And every one of them is standing somewhere in this line waiting for me to scan their ticket to a better life. Seems like niggas will never accept any other nigga that don't fit into their tiny idea of what a nigga can be. Any kind of sparkle, the sparkle's too sweet, they gotta spit on. Shoving out the shine and stomping out the sugar. But I realized a long time ago that sometimes Black hate black more than any white ever could. And knowing that I'm going to a place where all I see is black, it scares the fuck out of me. So yeah, the shit ain't easy, but I sashayed my sexy ass on the work so I can get this coin and make this flight. You hear me talking about some easy. Nigga, that color your skin decided to wear today. It ain't never to comfort in a word like that. Black folks ain't meant to know that kind of word. Knowing that kind of word just makes you weak as fuck and dull. That's why if I ever see easy, I'm across the motherfucking street because that nigga is evil. The nigga ain't nothing but ignorance. Nigga ain't nothing but darkness and destruction, fire and death. Baby, you ain't gonna find easy nowhere on that plane, so don't go looking for him. This here flight is meant to take us back to a place where we can start over, hmm? build, and own something, something that can never again be taken away. Us leaving this land ain't what's easy, and it ain't what's smooth. It's what builds. Now please, Step forward.